Hello and welcome to the DAF Driver Academy, where we've put together a short series of video clips to help you understand and become familiar with the speed control features on your vehicle. Becoming familiar with these features is not only good for the environment and for fuel economy, but it's also good for us as drivers. Because an informed driver is a relaxed driver and a relaxed driver is a safe driver. So let's take a look at the downhill speed control. What is downhill speed control? Downhill speed control is a feature incorporated within cruise control and limiter that automatically limits the vehicle speed on a descent by employing the vehicle's engine braking functions. Its main purpose is to assist the driver with smooth and economic driving along with radically reducing the wear on the pads and so reducing cost whilst increasing productivity. Depending on vehicle specification, if the speed of the vehicle increases, firstly the exhaust brake is engaged. If the speed is still increasing, the MX engine brake or the retarder is also engaged to maintain the desired downhill speed control setting. If the speed then decreases, the MX engine brake or retarder is deactivated to maintain the desired downhill speed control setting. If the speed decreases further, the exhaust brake is deactivated as well. And as long as there is enough braking torque, the set speed will be maintained and limited. However, if the available braking force is not sufficient, i.e. a very steep gradient, you will need to use the service brakes. When cruise control is activated, the downhill set speed defaults to three miles per hour above the cruise control set speed. To adjust this setting, press the middle button to bring up the speed control menu in the dip. Toggle to highlight the downhill speed control and using either of the plus and minus switches you can change the setting. Remembering legal speed limits of course. But bear in mind on limiter the downhill speed control is a non-adjustable preset at two kilometers an hour above your set speed. We hope you found this short video clip useful. Further information can be found on the DAF blog or by contacting your local DAF dealer or the DAF Driver Academy. Thank you for watching.